Okay, and welcome to another online lesson of creative writing. Today, we're having a look at writing a letter to your parents explaining that you've gone to ninja school. So it's something a little bit different than we've done this before. So I'm going to spend a little bit of time organizing the work, looking at how to include the word of the day, and showing you how to write a letter, basically telling your parents that you've gone away to ninja school. Okay, so the first thing I want to look at is the organization. Now, organization means just how the letter is set out. So I've put two little boxes in here. Okay, obviously you don't need to draw the boxes, you can just write on, but for the purposes of me here, I need us to be able to write in properly. Now, this top left box is the box where, where the person who is writing the letter is currently staying. Okay, so in here, I'm going to write where I am now. It's Ninja Academy. So obviously, it's a bit secret. It's a sort of hidden. So I'm not going to say the exact location. So I'll say I'm at my name for it. So Jamestown. Then I'll write the illustrious. Illustrious is a really good word. It, it means uh, very famous, very, basically, a really good word for excellence. So illustrious Ninja Academy hidden locations. I'm not going to give away the whole thing. There, so hidden location. Oh, and of course, before I do that, I'll need to just put the date. So the 20th of April, 2020. And here is where you put the address of the letter where you'd like it to go. So let's imagine you want to escape the nin um, and go to the Ninja Academy. So you're maybe you're escaping, going somewhere from somewhere that's quite boring. So I'm gonna write, okay, so Mr. Downs Parents, 67 Boring Street, Dull Town, Bland City. Okay. And all of these are just different words meaning boring. So you're escaping a boring life and you're going somewhere fun and interesting to learn ninja skills. So that's the organization taken care of. Well, for now. And then there's first person. That means that we're going to be writing using I and me. Okay. Specific vocabulary. I've just noted down a few that I might use here. So stealthy, silent, sneaky. Shinobi is another word for ninja. And lessons, because it's a school, isn't it? So we talk about the lessons that we might be using there. And the word of the day is nimble, which means quick on your feet, fast, or agile. So agile is also another good word that you might not know. It means the same as fast and well-balanced. You'd say that a, a squirrel is quite an agile animal. Okay, so I'm starting writing the actual letter. So you start with your right. So dear parent. New line. As you may know, I have always wanted to become a ninja. So I've taken not an, I'll go back and I'll think, an opportunity or the opportunity. The opportunity. Taken the opportunity to train with some of the world's most elite ninjas. I think I've got a better idea for with later, so I'll leave that for now. So what I've done here is I've done an opening statement. So basically I'm saying what the letter is going to be about. After that, I'll move on. I'll give a couple of points, just explaining a little further why I've decided to run off to be a ninja. So I'll introduce my next point and I'll think, okay, so firstly, let's think some reasons why you might want to run away to become a ninja. Okay, so ninjas are very agile. They're very skillful. You might want to have uh, really, you might just want to become really, really fit. So firstly, I have taken this choice in order to, now this is a posh way of saying so, so let's put that in a little bracket there, 
in order to become fit, healthy, and agile. This should move on just a little bit. I'll keep going. I'm going to explain how I'll become fit, healthy, and agile. As a ninja, or as a shinobi, because I've used ninja quite a lot. As a shinobi, I will learn how to be... Let's think. Let's go up to the words that we already wrote down. Uh, okay, so sneaky, stealthy, silent. I'll try and use some of those words as I go. I'll learn how to be sneaky and stealthy. And I'm not sure this is making sense at the minute, so I'm just going to go back and think. As I should know, I will need to know how to be sneaky and stealthy. And I'm linking this in now to this option here of being fit and healthy. As you know, we all need to learn how to be sneaky and stealthy and being at the peak, that means at the top, at the peak of my fitness will only help this. Now I'm going to go on to the next reason. So the next reason is that I believe that this Ninja Academy is going to allow children to perform really vital duties, so really good missions. So secondly, change the font there a second. Bear with me. Get a bit bigger for you. So secondly, ninjas are always given top secret missions which can be so important that they might even save the world. And I'm going to try and persuade my parents that I'm doing the right thing here. So I'm going to use a rhetorical question. Don't you want to have children who are heroes for the entire world? I know I would. So again, I'm going to if I'm trying to persuade my parent, then that's a really good persuasive technique there. Now I'll continue and I'll do a third one. Um, so I'll do in addition. I don't like the word thirdly. So in addition, and my third one is going to be about teamwork. So ninjas have to work as a team. Okay, so again, I'm trying to persuade my grown-ups that I've made the right choice here. Not that they have any choice in the matter. I'm already at the Ninja Academy. That's another issue. So in addition, when you are trained, no, so right in the third person. So when I am fully trained, not just trained, fully trained to be an elite level ninja, my teamwork and cooperation will be at amazing levels. When I come home, and this is how I'm going to really persuade the grown-ups again, so when I come home, you'll be amazed at how well or how much I can help out around the house. I used amazing and amazed twice there. So I'm going to change one. Amazing, I might change to fantastic. There we go. I made sure that I used better adjectives here. So fully trained, elite level ninja, not just a ninja, but an elite level ninja. Now I'm going to leave that there. Now most letters would have three or four paragraphs saying why okay and at the end you just want a quick brief summary or just to say when you next see them so that's what i'm going to do i'm going to quickly say when i next see them before i sign off at the end 
So I hope that you don't take this news too badly. And I'll just reassure my parents as well. I am in very safe hands with my teacher. And a teacher in um, well, in Japanese, the word for teacher or professor is sensei. So I'll just say sensei um, Tanaka. All right. I'm in very safe hands with my teacher, Sensei Tanaka. Um, I'm not going to write thank you, but I will write your loving son. I'll just write my name here, James. So at the end, I've got just a little sentence to try and make them feel a little bit better. And I've written who it's from. So you might write something like yours sincerely in a more formal letter, but because this is to parents, I'm going to write your loving son, and I've written my name, but you might write your loving daughter, your loving child, or whatever you fancy. Okay, I'll have a quick read through and check if there's anything, because I know there was something I want to change. Ah, here it is. So, as you may know, I have always wanted to become a ninja, so I've taken the opportunity to train with now I like with I also like the word amongst so to train amongst so that means you're like training within them and then making you part of the group so I like that and I'm also just going to put a little comma after my soul there and I'll get rid of this because we know what in order this is a posh way of saying so there we go and I might add if I had more time, I would write, I'd add more to this section and add a little bit more detail. I like the rhetorical questions in here to persuade. Boop. And I think I'm done. Okay, looking forward to seeing your own versions. Enjoy.